Hello friends, once again welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna be talking about a few things that's very important for anyone who is interested in studying H-Work Engineering. And this is very important for those who wants to become a H-Work Technician. Whatever it is, we all know that piping is very important things in H-Work application, especially chilled water piping. Similarly, knowing about piping components is very important to us. So today I'm going to show you some of the words that are very important in HVAC application. A valve is a device for controlling the flow of fluid in a pipeline. Control may mean limiting or throttling flow, preventing backflow or completely stopping flow. Automatic control valves we will discuss later in another video. In this video, we are going to discuss only about manually operated valves. There are a great many different and uh, configurations of, of manual valves. They can be grouped into a few general classes. One is stop valves. Stop valves are used for shut off flow. The primary reason is to allow isolation of equipment or section of piping for repair or replacement. Traditionally, the most common stop valves has been the gate valve. In the full open position, the gate is out of the way and resistance to flow is minimal. In the fully closed position, the gate seats tightly and flow is effectively stopped. The gate valve is not a good throttling device. Gate valves are made in many sizes, configurations and materials to handle more, almost any fluid or pressure. Next one is throttling valves. Throttling valves can be adjusted to control flow quantities within limits which depend on the system pressure variations. For throttling control, the globe type valves is often recommended. Globe valves are made in many configurations but all have a shaped plug such that gradual throttling can be accurately accomplished. Many different sizes, materials and pressure rating are available. Next one is backflow prevention valves. Backflow prevention valves including check valves are used to prevent flow in the wrong direction. Reverse flow may occur as a result of pressure changes and may degrade system performance or may even be dangerous. Backflow preven uh, prevention valves are usually called check valves and come in several types. The most common is the swing check, a flapper swing open to allow flow in one direction but closes if flow is reversed. These valves must be mounted so that gravity will assist in closing the flapper. A spring-loaded check valve including a spring to assist in closing the flapper, consequently it has a higher resistance to flow. A lift check arranged so that uh, the flapper lifts off the seat to allow flow. Next is pressure reducing valves. Pressure reducing valves provide control of downstream pressure regardless of upstream pressure variations. As long as upstream pressure exceeds downstream pressure, pressure relief valves are safety device which open to relieve excessive pressure which might damage the system. A pressure reducing valve is an automatic control valve, usually a globe type, with a diaphragm operator which acts to modulate flow through the valves to maintain a specified downstream pressure. For compressible fluids such as steam, air or gas maximum flow through the valve occur at a ratio of downstream pressure to upstream pressure which is the critical pressure drop for the fluid that is uh, 0.53 for steam thus if a greater than 50 percent reduction is uh, required it is best to use two or three stages of pressure reduction for good control Next one is butterfly valve. In larger piping over 3 or 4 inch, it may be less expensive to use a butterfly valve. Butterfly valves are made in flange, wafer or tapped lug configuration. Do not use a wafer valve for dead end service because it is held in place by clamping between the adjoining pipes. The tapped lug body works as a flange union joint and can be used for dead end service. Butterfly valves are available in a more limited range of pressure rating and uh, materials compared to gate valve. Next is bowl valve. The bowl valve has gained great popularity in recent years. 
a ball valve is similar to a plug valve but has a spherical plug with a round hole drilled through the center mounted in the valve body. Ball valve have become the valve of choice over gate and globe valves in many applications for reason of cost and performance.